I'm Vivian, and you can just call me Vivian because the, the name is easily to remember. I'm studying here for our, my master degrees in fine art. I'm studying in fine art as well when I in my undergraduate, and I feel like I need to change environment after I finished my four years degrees. So I feel as searching for the schools abroad and the English is the second language which I have already learned for about five to six years. Mm -hmm. So I feel okay, maybe the Europe. Europe is kind of my dream place. Not not USA, not Canada, so I feel oh, maybe UK. Mm -hmm. The printmaking studios here is quite a it looks really brilliant, so I choose here. Because it's really hard to find the printmaking courses in the UK. So there are about four or five unis in UK that have contains printmaking and Newcastle contains the biggest printmaking studio space here. So that's why I choose here. These studios mm -hmm. are kind of the main the main place we will staying here, creating our works and doing our own stuff, you know, as you see, weird things a lot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and and our classmates were sitting there, we're just communicating about our ideas, what we are doing now, or just having a nice talk about the art movement, things like that. I think that's the main progress that we are making, because you can have sharing the ideas with other people. I'm doing mainly doing painting mm -hmm. and, and making a little op art object and I don't know just I, there are so many different things that I, I do scenery painting, I do data visualization. Natu you will nat naturally add your personal identity inside your artwork no matter what what you are painting. Like I'm I will use some kind of Asian traditional paper to stick on my scenery paintings and that's my UK classmates they were not doing for their painting. Yeah. These are all the number blocks I've made before and these number blocks I can be stick on the wall but can also be doing some stamping. I'm really enjoying the stamping recently, so there are so many stampings here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I think that's, be that's because I'm from a totally different culture people, so English, these la the language of English is kind of in fast, uh, attract me to do some little stamping and the crossword things like Map, making a new words and the crosswords inside our painting like these are all the uh, stamping off and combined with the painting and the red blocks they are kind of the mandarin mandarin signs mm. in my language wow. and those are english like you can see bilingual there mm -hmm. Bilingual is my main topic in this painting. These, uh, the board line, they are all kind of stamping by these alphabets. And the word I'm using is enigma. Mm -hmm. So they, these continents are all kind of mysteries for me to discover them. So, wow. And now they, now they are kind of in the first, first stage, the, only the structure. Mm -hmm. It's like you are trying to seek what are what are you truly engaged inside? What's the topic you are interested in, and and what's your relationship between you and these topics? Mm -hmm. And this, I think, this is the the most interesting things that you can find. It.